Welcome back to Star Fox Adventures. We got ourselves a Kozoa Spirit and we're gonna go to the Kozoa Palace and it's gonna be yip yip born wahoo wahey. What do you think? Krozoa. Yes, that's great. Are you anyway, Krozoa. to go to Krozoa Palace? I am ready. He sends us back to the same place, but the problem with Krozoa Palace is that it's gonna be a bit harder to figure out where the Krozoa thing actually is. Hmm. Here it's a bit tricky. <laughs> You're good. Hey. That was yeah. funny. I love using that pun. I think I'm gonna use it for every episode from here on out. Don't do it. No, I will not. That's a bad idea. So once again, we're zoomed here. Once again, there's two sharp claw there. Once again, we'll ignore them. Uh, it's this part of the game that I just love. You know, the backtracking. You don't even want to say hi. Ah, rude. <laughs> I noticed there the the sharp claw theme. You know, it comes in immediately, and then it's like, oh, okay, bye. Well, you start to learn that these guys are real stinking idiots. Like, stinking idiots is what they are. They are idiots that stink. <laughs> the universe needs me. I'm on my way. General Scales is leading stupid, idiotic dinosaurs. Probably inbred. That's why they all look alike. Well, hey, if you actually think about it, the size of the army counts here. They don't need intelligence when there's a hundred thousand of them coming at you. Yeah, they're strong. I'll give them that. I'd, I'd call one of them stupid. I wouldn't call, like, an entire group of them stupid. Like, you break into a Sharp Claw bo uh, poker game, and they're just like, So, what's up? The thing about this door is that uh, there needs to be a fan on, so we can't go here yet. But I'd, I'd wager that'd be probably the next one, or probably the last one. I don't know. Right? But uh, no doors up here. Just a side note and get back to the Let's Play for a minute, but continue if you had anything else. Well, I'm just saying, you know, you go in, call them all stupid, and then they go, Hey, it's not nice. And then you can't take them because there's like nine of them. Well, keep the fact that they're stupid in mind for the ending. Oh, okay. Just so you know. <laughs> My planet needs me. <laughs> <laughs> I must be off. <laughs> I don't think I ever mentioned it, but this theme is actually pretty nice. Yeah, the music's pretty good. Gotta give it that. See, a lot of a lot of heart went into this, a lot of effort went into this, and I always recognize it. Was this done by the the regular Rare uh, musician? This was Rare's last game before being bought by Microsoft. So seal of quality is all there. Yes. By the way, portal door opens the portal door, so we can get the one that you can get through opening the portal door, because we got the portal door now. Get it? show that four times for dramatic effect. Because we haven't done this four times already. <laughs> oh, shit! Fox gets sucked in the crystal, too. <laughs> Lovely. Yeah! <laughs> Tricky yeah, that, that was... What are you doing, Fox? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Somebody comes in completely unrelated. So, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> Crystal's there like, uh, what on earth? Are you... So now the game just points us in the next direction because it has nothing else for us. It has literally nothing else. Fox, my boy! Three spell stones <laughs> down and only one to go! Boy, and the deadline's approaching! Boy! Oh Time god, the bagpipes kick in. To go to Cause he's Scottish! Get it? If it starts playing say. Amazing Grace, but I quit. Where I find the so, where's the gatekeeper for this fourth spell stone? He is closer than you realize. It's me! He who has no voice <laughs> I'll throw you there! <laughs> I, I just want the warp stone to just chuck him off into the next place. It's an old-fashioned warp! <laughs> I'll give but you a little yo And then a toss! <laughs> oh, man. So, the gatekeeper is somewhere on this map. He is some thorn tail here that, you know, they always have so much to talk about. I haven't talked to everybody yet, but he's a guy who doesn't have a whole lot to say. And we don't know anybody like that, because everybody's got a whole lot to say. Like this guy. Give me lovely green moss any time. <laughs> Actually, I'm just gonna eat this rock. It's like a salt lick. Tastes good. Oh, Lasts longer too. Five out of five. Uh, would listen to again. Scales cannot be allowed to get away with this. 
Well, he kind of is, I'm afraid. <laughs> Plot twist, he did. What about this guy? I should have guessed there was something odd about you. The what? Warpstone said I should find you. Uh, oh, I yeah, we, we actually him. saved him from those bad guys. Never thanked us. Happened. Something that I am ashamed to admit. I too attempted to save our planet, but I failed. Tell me, what happened? I just I did. I failed. <laughs> I'm just listening to this ambient piano music, and while well, he's telling us this sob story, when we could be saving the entire world by the time you were supposed to feel bad for me. Please. Three of my closest friends on Dragon Rock, and it is also where he has taken the Spellstone. Oh no! So how did you survive? No. If Scales let you go. It could only be because I am the gatekeeper. <laughs> <gasps> I don't know why I let you go. I mean, he was doing pretty good there keeping Tricky's dad on the walled city. I mean, yeah. We are the gatekeeper. All of us are the that that didn't make any sense to me. The no, it didn't. <laughs> Dragon Rock is now open. Please help my friends. I always knew they every Zelda game side. should have a dragon boss. Alright, so now we got our last portal open to go get the last spell stone. Isn't that great? I'm excited. Well, one problem though. Ha! We need 15 fuel cells, we don't have enough. We we got all the ones that we got, but we just don't have enough. But don't worry, folks, there's one more thing to do. Or this is the probably the final time we will ever need to go back into the shop. <gasps> no! We probably don't need to come back for anything else. Because we got the cheat token, we got all the maps, we got all the items. Really, we got all the fuel cells, too, because once we do this, it's unlocked forever, I think. So, this is really only the last time we're going to come back in here. But there's two more things that we're going to do while we're in here. Might as well show the, the extra bonus thing off before we say goodbye to this place forever. This is the Scarab game. How about playing a little game? It's fucking rigged, is what it is. how many scarabs <laughs> you wish to gamble? Oh, you're gambling, uh oh. I will them into this cave, and you have to collect them within my time limit. And read without subtitles. That's what I was <laughs> Well, I don't really give a shit how much because, again, I've discovered infinite money, but the, the max that you can donate is ten. I say donate, because look look at this shit. If you're gonna throw scarabs everywhere, go! <laughs> Not so good this time. What? I'll keep what you didn't collect. I don't know what happened, and frankly, I don't really care too much. So, let's go to the other thing. Wow, that's terrible! I think it was a matter of me, uh, I don't know if it was a matter of time, or a matter of me getting one of those black scarabs that would have ended the game, or I don't know, but... Either way, we got here a fuel cell. Oh. You pay this much. So if you're short, you can just use whatever extra scarabs no, that you can get, which again, you can get in the area for free okay, forever. I'll sell it to you. And then, well, well, there you go. Luckily, they don't give us the da 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 yeah. Okay. You're ever low on consumables. Oh, okay. R really, the only time I ever come in here, aside from maybe to get out and some health or whatever. That's, that's it for the store. We probably never have to come back here again. No! Probably not. So say goodbye to it. And climb this wall one last goddamn time. Goodbye, store. Oh, well, that All was right. underwhelming. <laughs> it, it, it was. <clears throat> you don't get any sort of fanfare. No. I lie, there's one more thing involving the store, but we're not going to do that for probably when we come back. Does that uh, require cheats? No, no, no. Oh, okay. Bonus episodes don't count, which will appear <laughs> after this series. So, for now, let's go ahead to Dragon Rock, get the last spellstone, get to putting this planet back together again. What do you say? Sonic Unleashed style? Uh, hmm. Put the Chaos Emeralds back in the temple! In a sense, kind of. But here it is, Dragon Rock. Emerald Scales has unleashed the full force of the planet's dark energy, hating Dragon Rock into a 
Slippy, you sound British. He's captured a number of dinosaurs, but is planning to change them into powerful killing machines. Oh, wow, I didn't even notice. This music clip is from the original, it was from Star Fox 64. Hey, figured it out. Helps if I actually turn the volume on. Helped if, if you uh, listen to some Star Fox music, it's a great soundtrack. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, ten gold rings. we got to go through all of them. Can we do it? Nope. Now, I'm going to focus. Now it's time to get my Star Fox instinct on. Yeah, I'm feeling this. There's one. And there goes the second one. And that's it. <laughs> right. There's two. The problem is, you don't know when you've missed one or not, unless if your teammate tells you that you missed one completely. Like, you see it, and you're like, oh, I missed it. And you're like, you missed it! Oh, shit. There's three. Whoops. There's oh. four. Tricky. I'm thinking, oh, shit. Was that one over there? That better not be one over there. That one. Oh, wait. Here's one. Five. Oh, six. Oh. Ah, all right. Oh, seven down there. Oh, man. This is worse than the eight flags on uh, Macbeth. <laughs> There's eight. Did I miss one in that? that oh, oh well. man, there's so much shit going on, I can't tell. There's nine. There better be one left. I'm not seeing it. Oh, wait. There it is. Oh. I did it. Yay! And ten. And one thing I forgot about. We get ten rings out of this. Nifty. Hmm... Dragon Rock is... Oh, God, Dragon fucking Rock, man. Is there just a bunch of dragons flying around? Oh. It's not particularly long, but... It, it's not particularly difficult, but holy it's fuck, are you gonna rip your hair out at some of these parts? Well, you will. Let's see, there's about... I'm trying to remember. There's like about five different challenges. Challenge number one. What the fuck do we do now? <laughs> so the first thing to do is just look around and look at stuff. See one of these things, can't do anything with those. <laughs> Dodge missile fire. There. Things that I probably can't kill because they've got a gigantic shield on them. That's wonderful. This looks a lot like the Boise Station in Star Fox 64. Oh yeah, totally. Yeah, there's a facility over there. Let's see what we can do here. I keep forgetting, there's way more than five challenges. This is just uh, a menace. What the hell? <laughs> One just... of the guns shot. Yeah. Enemies can <laughs> attack other enemies in this game. Huh. I think I figured out how to finally kill these things. But it's not here. I don't think. Where is it? I think I just. Nope, nope. Oh well, fuck it. Let's just go for slime. <laughs> well, I'm glad you showed off combat with these new Dodongos. I was close, though. I just waited too long to hit him. Oh, okay. You gotta freeze him and then attack him. I didn't know that the first time, because who fucking cares? They don't, they don't, they don't matter. Ah. Okay, good. I was hoping we'd catch on fire. We met our quota for the day. Let's see if we can, uh, <laughs> yeah. go, you, let's see if we can go over. There's a lot of fire in this level. You, you can't be burning yourself anymore. You'll have a surplus. We can't have that. So pushing on these buttons makes the fire go away. Okay. And we got a barrel mover thing over there. I can't oh, have Tricky stand no. on these because for some reason he can't climb this ladder. It's too high, Fox! <laughs> and it's hot! <laughs> oh, so God. This probably, yeah, that activates it. So, we need a barrel now. Awesome. Don't, don't we? And then, there's our barrel. Who designed this fortress? Oh, wow, really? I want whoever designed this game to go back and try again. Shit. That should have been done, like, what, 20 episodes ago? I mean, a lot of the things that we're going to do today is the opposite of fun. I mean, it's so not fun, you're going to you're gonna not have fun with me. You're going to be right there feeling the pain I'm going to feel. Yay. All right, so this one's pretty self-explanatory. Self mm -hmm. Stay on the button. Fire to pass by. And book it. Barrel passes by. Move over the next one. Don't book it too early. Excellent. And then once it passes, you're safe. And the barrel won't pick back up or anything, so no need to worry about that. Okay, good. Yeah. Uh, five stars. That was really good. 
Oh, man, I... I don't know how I did half the shit around here. <laughs> Just trial and error. Oh, Jesus. Well, There's too much fire in this level. This is supposed to be the Ocean Force Point Temple Spellstone. Why is there so much fire for an Ocean Force Point Spellstone? Well, why is there so much fire in the game to begin with? Because dinosaurs equal fire, I guess. Well, I'm just thinking, like, every single level has been a fire level. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about it, brother! <laughs> well, what did that do? Good question. I'm trying. I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, What's this? This looks like something. Remember it, it's important. Okay. Hello there. Are uh, we to be friends? Are you lost? Wait, where are you going? Have no, you seen the movie Catching Fire? I love that one. Except this time I'm throwing it. See if you can catch it. Okay. You know Firefox is my favorite browser. This girl is on fire! All right, let's cool it on the fire puns. Flame on. Oh, yeah. Anyway, what am I doing? Why are there, like, ancient cannons flying around this fiery area? This game has zero consistency. <laughs> I mean, you think it's it's supposed to be, like, medieval kind of times because of the, the, the tribal village of the Lightfoots and the monarchy of the Lightfoot. Do you think it's like sometime in like, you know, the Renaissance or the medieval times, something like that. But then you pull out these ancient cannons, the Magi technology, and the portal technology, and the fact that our staff can be upgraded by the technology found on this planet. You know, it's it's a little inconsistent. I'd like to know more about the planet I'm trying to save. <laughs> I've realized with this soundtrack, you know, being kind of like tribal and everything, I just want to eventually hear. To find me. Okay. Friend. Friend others. times. Yeah, I know. This is a, this is a good man. Friend told me all about it. I am pleased to hear of his safety. But the He's going to help us so fuck fortunate. shit up and Together, make this level a lot more fun. For you. No, I'm not paid enough for this. Okay, okay. What do we do? The hard to use that joke, will be an easy target. Yeah, quit your bitching. robots. With their shields, they are unstoppable. However, each one has a shield generator hidden uh -huh. somewhere nearby. Uh -huh. If we can destroy these, the robots yeah. will be <laughs> at the top of those towers. So what do you expect? But we need four to keys to unlock this every shield generator. So that's not. a total of sixteen keys yes. hidden buried among the field. Now get on my back. But actually, Let's no. Do some damage. Uh, yeah, we're gonna ride a fucking dinosaur. Oh my god, it's about time! Game full of dinosaurs and you can't ride them till now? We should have done this at the beginning. Or, like, the mammoth should have been the taste, and then the next should have been a fucking dinosaur. So anyway, I didn't mean to cut you off. I'm just riding myself a dinosaur now who crashes into things. Uh, what were you saying again? No, uh, that pretty much trumps everything. I was just gonna make a stupid joke about the uh, Donkey Kong Country cartoon, so, yeah, forget it. Oh, uh, yeah, that's where you ride a rhino. Well, I'm riding a dinosaur right now, uh, so, uh, I don't think what you were saying has any matter anymore. It's kind of, it's kind of like a triceratops, you know, a rhino. Sorry, uh, my, my dinosaur's footsteps are far too loud for anyone to, uh, talk over. And yet anyway, you're still dying. <laughs> back to the Let's Play, that's what that does. And I'm thinking, oh. I'm thinking, oh no, do I gotta throw a fucking barrel into those things because there's a crack. <laughs> you see a crack, and you think, you gotta throw a barrel in there because maybe you just disabled the shield, protecting the shield, you gotta do it in because I know this game, they'd fucking do it. They definitely would do it. Well, that's two. Let's see if I can't find any more. Uh, oh, oh shit, he's still getting hurt. Ow. Yeah, see, there's a crack in there. I think that uh, maybe you can damage it some more, but you can't. It's okay, so we'll just get to where I get the next ones. Fade out? Uh, no time. I think I'm riding a dinosaur right now. Uh, we have no time for fade outs. We're gonna be destroying some shields, man. Wherever they are. <laughs> just throw your Triceratops at the robots. Just pick it up and throw it. You know what? Just pick up the Triceratops and throw it at him. I don't know why I didn't, I didn't do that to Tricky, but hey, there's one. <laughs> oh, that should be his new one. ability! <laughs> Wouldn't it be cool to ride Assault Tricky? Where he's all grown up and everything? Hmm. That's something that was missing from Star Fox Assault. 
Because that, that mission was shit. It'd be so cool if uh, Trigger would be like, Here, Fox, climb on! We'll take those baddies out one by one! You can, like, shoot rocket launchers on top of them. Oh my Dude, god! let me design the next That Star would Fox be game. so cool! Alright, there's one more shield generator to the left. Seriously, they don't throw any more crap on you. Those shields really do degenerate. But, just, just you gotta find that damn thing. Do it. Wherever it is. Hey, he's running out of health, dude. Stop killing your dinosaur friend. He's fine. He's fine. Don't worry about him. He, he will be all right. <sighs> He'll be better once he finds it. You know what would be better design? If you run over the mushrooms, you get your health back. Or if you get them, you just run over and get them. So that we finally... Ha ha! Who's running now? I am with my dinosaur that I'm on top of. That I'm riding. This is the most exciting thing that's happened in this entire game. I, I'm having fun. I, I, I got back to having fun. But of course, when they give you fun, they follow it up right over with punishment. <laughs> he dies in the field of battle. Now that we've disabled the shields, we have to destroy them ourselves because, well, those things are too high. So now we are off the dinosaur for a good long while. Forever. We're going to have to fight long and hard before the game gets fun again because Dragon Rock has... Oh, it's got two faces. This is just this is the opening act. This is to unlock the true devil that is Dragon Rock. The first one is a series of unbelievably terrible challenges that make me grind my teeth every time I think about it. And then it follows up with something awesome. So that's what we've got in store for the rest of this level. And then that's it. We got the fourth spellstone. Oh, cool. So uh, this is going to be far different than anything we've seen so far. Right now we're just getting the same stuff out of the way before we start breaking genres again. Okay, okay. So after the spellstone, is the game basically over? Okay. Let's see if I can pick him up from here. Oh, I oh. hit him once. Oh, oh 360 no scope. Oh. Oh. And. oh, one more. And. Oh! 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 <laughs> anyway. Uh, MLG is awesome. It's so silly, but I love it. <laughs> I, I love it way more than I should. I hate you showing me MLG. <laughs> you hate me for showing you a lot of things. Yeah, yeah. Like but this. But that one's actually pretty awesome. MLG. <laughs> <laughs> Not uh, this, no. Uh, was that four? I don't think it was. I think we got one more left. You got tree, me. You got tree. You got tree? No. Tree. Well, four somewhere. Luckily, they're located in different parts of the world, and if you got your uh, high-def scope... This kind of comes in handy here because this is a very oh. large map. There, there he is. Found him. Good Can't job, SD Scope. Me. I am a recon man, 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 man. <laughs> so what happens, you know, like you look through the high def scope and then you're suddenly in Star Fox Wii U. Whoa, look. That'd be kind of cool. Don't make... Oh, man. Got my hopes up. <laughs> now I'm going to put a lot of... I'm going to put a lot of... Uh, Unvested hope into Star Fox Assault. I mean, yeah, Star Fox Wii U. That would be pretty amazing. Yeah. It's gonna be great though if me and Moda's behind it. Yeah. Because he never put out a crap game. <coughs> Wait, music. Ahem. We don't talk about that one. Well, I guess there's some kind of dinosaur locked up here, but I, I don't really care too much about that. He can die for all we care. Ride him. Yeah. In fact, well, I can't even really see him because I can't go up any further to see his head. He has no head. Well, I'm sure he's chained up for a perfectly good reason. I mean, the Sharp Claw, they're, they're not unreasonable. I mean, they don't go out looking for 